No complaints about the weather tonight as we see nothing but stars in this contest between set to bring you one monster of a game. And here come the mean green. As a big time quarterback who can really put up some big numbers against his defense. I look for him to have an outstanding game spreading the ball to his receiver. player to watch today is on the defensive side of the ball, lining up at cornerback. Yep, when this kid steps up, this defense plays a lot better. He does a good job of locking down receivers and taking away one side of the field. Kirk, I know you like this kid. How do you think he'll play? It's hard to say, Coach. He's going up against some great receivers today. We'll keep an eye on him as the game plays out. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. The Hilltoppers set up in the gun. Tackle at the 41-yard line. First down. The defense is looking for the pass as they bring out their dime package. Looks to pass. Throwing left. Incomplete pass. Brown was the intended target on the play. So that'll make it second down. It's second down and 10 to go. Brown with three wide receivers. Doty on the give. And he's taken down at the 40. That'll be a pickup of a yard. They line up at the 40. Third down, nine to go. Western Kentucky comes out in the shotgun. He drops back, looking, he's thrilled as he throws. He was under some pressure there. Well, sometimes as a quarterback, you have so many things to worry about. What's the coverage, where's the pressure coming from, and so on, that you lose focus at times throwing a catchable ball. Here, he just missed the target. First and ten, ball on their own 20. Brown is back in the gun. With the spin, he dives forward. Jackson with the tackle at the 39. On defense, it's all about instincts. It didn't look like their instincts worked too well on that play. <laughs> You're right, Lee. There was a lot of running room there. Brown changes the play at the line. Brown drops back on first down. Rolls right. He throws it. Incomplete. And there wasn't anyone in the vicinity. I think the ball just slipped out on him. Maybe it did, but boy, that hurts. That could have been a big, big play. The mean green. Bring in the nickel package. Turner takes a handoff. He spins. Carter tackles him at the 41-yard line. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. It's third down and eight to go. They'll bring in their dime package. Back to pass. Looking. Throws. Got him on the run. Diving for extra yardage. To the 10. Touchdown, Western Kentucky. The wideout makes a big catch there. Hey, whenever you have a receiver who can make plays like that, you just want to get the ball in his hands and let him do the work. Listen up, my friend. That was a tremendous throw by the quarterback, too. Don't forget about the guy slinging the ball all over the field out there. It's a direct snap. With the spin, dives for extra yardage. He's into the open field. In the end, yes, touchdown. No problem getting six there, guys. I'll tell you what, I don't care what this kid's 40 time is or what he benches. The only reason he found the end zone was because he saw the blocks, used great vision, and then got it into the end zone. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 32-yard line. The Hilltoppers line up with three wide. He's looking to pass. He looks. He rolls out to the right. He's going to take off. He's taken down at the 33-yard line. 
Quarterback picked up a yard at best there on the scramble. Second and nine. Ball on the 33. They're in the eye. Turner on the inside handoff. Tackle to the 38-yard line. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. Third down. Brown comes to the line with three wide. He's rolling right. He unloads it. The senior makes the catch. There's a player shaking up on the play. Well, let's hope it's not serious, but his arm's got to be hurting after a shot like that. It's first and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Western Kentucky comes to the line with three wide. Rolling out to the right side. Going deep. And they finally knock him out at the 14-yard line. And that's the way you're supposed to play pitch and catch. Absolutely. You know, this wide receiver is a difference maker. He's one of those players that has a chance to go the distance every time you get him the ball. The Hilltoppers line up with four wideouts. Turner gets the call. Touchdown, Western Kentucky. And he manages to find the end zone for the second time this half. Yep, he's really finding his way into the end zone. He's off to a great start. First and ten. Ball on the 49. Western Kentucky goes to the ace set here. Brown still has it. Rolls to the right. He throws right. Can't hang on. Incomplete. Mm -hmm. It's going to go down as a drop, my friend. Mm -hmm. A very frustrating drop. I like the play call. I like the pass even more, but it really doesn't matter if the receiver can't bring it in. Brown drops back. He's rolling left. Got hit as he threw. His receiver has it. He spins around. He's all the way down to the 17-yard line. Western... We'll see what they can do in the red zone. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one will result in another touchdown. And down he goes at the 15-yard line. Gain of two. The Hilltoppers set up in the gun. Brown set to go to the air. Throws this one out to the right. That one sailed on him. He wanted his receiver, but I think that may have slipped out of his hand. Third down. The Hilltoppers are lining up with three receivers. Brown at the pass. Looks. Let's it fly. This one is incomplete. He overshot his target there. One of the things that is important here is that they come up with the blitz and don't give the quarterback enough space to throw the football. First down, 10 to go. The Hilltoppers line up in a goal line formation. Brown on the option. Across midfield, at the 40, at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Got He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. This kid has been a very integral part of this team's success today, fellas. Absolutely. He's run the ball extremely well between the tackles. That's his third touchdown of the day. A successful offense needs a successful running attack, and that's exactly what this kid brings to the table. First and ten. Ball in the 34.
Brown, back in the gun. Brown, on first down. Rolling out to the left side. He throws it. On this receiver. I'll tell you, this receiver showed really good hands on that play. This kid is always calling for the ball. And if he keeps making plays like that, he'll continue to get the ball. Three wideouts yeah. here. Brown, back to throw. Rolls right. Throws this one out to the right. And that one's incomplete. Tight end had some trouble holding on to that one. Can you blame him? You can see how hard he got hit. He did get hit pretty hard. But come on, coach. You have to hang on to the ball. Sweetheart, easy for you to say you're here in the booth. The Hilltoppers set up in the gun. Brown drops the throw. He heaves it deep. And he's got it! He's all the way down to the six-yard line. A heck of a play by the receiver. We talk all the time about the emotions of college football. This play was definitely an emotionally charged play. What a way for the wideout to make a statement in this game. Going with the shotgun here. Brown hasn't thrown a bad one this drive. Flips it, catches it. Munker with the tackle at the five. One yard on the play. Here we go from the five-yard line. Western Kentucky lines up with three receivers. Brown options out. Another touchdown. Nice job by the offense to get the final few yards to the end zone. Yeah, they knew what play to call for in that situation and made it work. First and ten. Ball on the 27. The mean green. Line up with six defensive backs. Brown drops back on first down. He rolls out to the right. They brought him down for the sack at the eight. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. They come out in a nickel. Looking to throw. Surveys the field. And it's incomplete. Brown was the intended target. That'll bring up third down. Third down and long coming up here. Ball on the eight-yard line. The Hilltoppers come to the line with their jumbo package. Brown steps back to pass. He lets it go. Got it. And he's all the way down to the 39-yard line. As if things haven't been bad enough. Yep. This is pretty much like adding salt to the wound. But we've seen this all game. They'll work from the shotgun. Direct snap to the back. Spinning. And he's taken down at the 40. Turner gains about a yard on the play. Second down and nine to go. Ball on their own 40. Brown comes to the line with three wide. Brown drops back, looks. Somehow gets the ball away. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here. Turner lines up in the deep back, eye formation. He went down pretty hard there. Coaches don't like it when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get on his lineman to protect the quarterback a little bit better. First and ten. Ball on the nine-yard line. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one will result in another touchdown. They'll work the left side. He's knocked out of bounds at the 19. A ten-yard gain. Second and inches. Ball on the 19-yard line. Brown lines up in the shotgun. He drops back. Looks. He's rolling right. He's taking off. 
And a big gain on the quarterback scramble. Easy play there. The receivers run the defenders off, and all the quarterback has to do was run for the vacant spot on the field. And don't forget about the awareness of the quarterback. Recognize... The Hilltoppers set up in the gun. They'll give it off here. Spin move. Brought down at the 39-yard line. A five-yard pickup by the halfback on the misdirection. They line up at the 39. Second and five coming up here. This defense is in the dime. Turner gets another handoff. There's a very impressive open field tackle. Time and time again, you see the team that's winning is usually the team that's able to control the line of scrimmage. Here, they again get a nice push, and the result was a solid run. From the 45-yard line, it's first down. Five DBs on the field. Brown will hand it off. Spin move. Thomas brings him down for a loss. So the halfback loses about two on the run. From the 47-yard line, it's second down. The Hilltoppers line up in a goal line formation. Brown with the give. To the 20. To the 10. And he dives forward. There's another. He does it again. And that gives him four rushing touchdowns on the day. Yo, four scores is pretty darn good. Just ask Abraham Lincoln. And that's pretty much going to do it. Kirk, any final thoughts here? I have never seen a team so heavily favored lose by so much. North Texas is probably going to say this game was a fluke and that there's no explanation for a loss like this. Call whatever you like, but the fact remains they just got their butts kicked out there. This is about drive, this is about power. We stay hungry, we do that. Put in the hours and take what's